Hello everyone. In the last video, we learned about the different devices used by a computer to work. And they are the input devices, the output devices, and the storage devices. Today, we will learn about the input devices. The devices which are used to enter data into a computer are called input devices. So whatever device we need to enter anything into the computer, whether it is letters, numbers, pictures or sound, they all are known as input devices. And the most common input devices are a keyboard, A keyboard can be joined to a computer CPU using a wire but can also be wireless. So you have two different type of keyboards available. One is a keyboard with a wire which can be connected to the CPU and the other one is a wireless keyboard. A keyboard has many buttons which are called keys. So the buttons that we see on the keyboard they are called keys. A keyboard is used for typing letters, words, numbers and special symbols. You will see this on the keyboard. You can see the letters on the keyboard. You can see the numbers on the keyboard and some special symbols as well. And we join the letters together to form words. The standard keyboard has 104 keys. So the standard keyboard that we use, it has 104 keys. It looks like this. It is also known as QWERTY keyboard. Now, why do we call it as QWERTY keyboard? Because the first row of letters has Q, W, E, R, T, Y on it. Mouse. A computer mouse has two buttons on it. You must have seen a mouse. It has two buttons on it. The left button and the right button. It is used to point, move and select any item on the computer screen or monitor. So we use a mouse to point, move and select any item on the monitor screen. And when we move the mouse, the pointer also moves on the screen. A mouse also helps us to draw pictures and play games. It is very difficult to draw pictures using a keyboard and mouse helps us to draw pictures easily and also play games on the computer and it looks like this. Mouse is also known as a pointing device. Mouse is an input device and we also call it as pointing device because when we move the mouse the pointer on the screen also moves with it. Microphone a microphone is used to record voice and different sounds into a computer. The way we use a keyboard to enter number, letters and special symbols and we use a mouse to draw pictures and play games. Similarly, if we want to record any sound or voice into the computer, for that we will need a microphone. It also helps us to talk to our friends through internet. Now, if you want to make an internet call and you want to talk to your friends, you will need a microphone so that the computer can take your sound. And it looks like this, like a mic. A microphone, sometimes referred to as a mic or mic, converts sound into an electronic signal. Now, it looks like a mic and it is sometimes also called a mic and it converts the sound into an electronic signal. Now, when you enter your sound into the computer, that sound is converted into an electronic signal so that that can be sent through internet to your friends.